Melly! Hello, Melly Moore. Oh, you've got an ad. Okay. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, Melly Moore. Wait, you can't even hear me. Do you have an ad? Well, hopefully, hopefully, that advert won't be too long. To be honest, I don't know how long the advert is. Could be a really long one. So I'm like, do I talk to Melly Moore while she's enjoying her advert or... Or, or, or do I wait a little bit? How long do I wait? I don't know when Melly Moore is going to be back from her advert, so I don't know what to do right now. I, I, I mean, I could just be here, like, talking to myself, because she's got, like, a 40-minute advert to get through. I don't know. Fingers crossed, though, that she has heard all of this. If she hasn't, then holy crap. I am literally going to be talking to myself. Okay! Okay, Melly Moore is back. The advert is over. Fantastic. I hope you enjoyed that advert. <laughs> ah. Anyway, Melly Moore, welcome. Welcome, my dear. Welcome, my darling. Doug Handler, welcome, my good sir. People, people are actually arriving. <gasps> Oh, thank you, thank you for joining me this fine and beautiful night, children. My beautiful, beautiful stream follower friends, I love you all. Ah, how is everyone today? I mean, I feel like I might know how Melly Moore is today, but what about the rest of you? The rest of you being Doug Antler right now. <laughs> ah, dear. Did you end up getting your Chinese food then, Melly? Did you uh, get your Chinese and your Starbucks? I hope you did. I hope you did. Ruby! Ad put here, yay. See, look, I can't talk to Ruby because he's in an ad. I I could, I could, can't say anything. I can't ask how Ruby is because he's in an advert. Oh, God. It's all right. I'll, I'll say something when he says something else. Doug Andler, I'm good. How about you? I am cold, Doug Andler. Holy moly, am I freezing. I mean, I kind of wish I was wearing this very lovely coat. Does anyone remember where I got this very lovely coat from? Anyone at all? No? I certainly don't. Yeah. It's a very lovely coat, though. I, I mean, it's far too lovely for me, but I'm just going to wear it anyway. Why not, eh? Why not? <sighs> ah. But yeah, I hope everyone is well. I still can't look down. I, I still can't look down or up. Um, that's interesting. I I still can't look up or down. Jake as mom with a ragey face. What is that? Is that swift rage? I don't know emotes. Why can't I look up or down? <gasps> what? I, why is my game broke? I don't quite understand. I played Overwatch. I can look up and down on that, but old Fallout, no. No. No looking up and down for old upstart DJ. Do you wanna look at this look at the sky? Old Eddie Cuts? No. No sky looking for you. What about at your feet? Hello. I apologize for Ooh. any disruptions that my work might cause you. <laughs> As I was saying, I can't look up or down. I <laughs> I'm, I, I'm not quite sure why. Like, what's what's going on here? God damn it! Yeah, yeah I can see and hear you. Well, thank you for thank you, Ruby. I'm glad you're able to see it, see and hear me now. Wait, well, you can see me? Oh, I hope not. You looking through my window? Is your controller broken? No, controller's fine. I've played Overwatch since, and I've been able to look up and shoot Farah out the sky with me expertly, I must add. But but no, apparently I can't do it here. Is there a control setting that I can tinker? Uh controls? Um Uh Uh No? Can't look up and down? I can do it like this. But I can't do it like this. Maybe switching weapon? 
How are you doing tonight, by the way, Jagaz? Apologies for not asking. Can I... Is, is, a, is, is a weapon dip change, like, useful? Can I... Can I, you know, do it with the old first Zapparino? No! Breaking stuff all the time. God damn it. I know, right? Then your playthrough is glitched. Time to start over. Holy moly. Really? Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Survive January, a race to level 50 uh, with with Melimore. We're doing it again in January. Oh yeah, some brand new characters and... <laughs> God damn it. If you, if you wore that jacket in real life, you would have radiation poisoning. You know what, Doug Andler? I'm so cold, I would take radiation poisoning. That's how cold I am right now. Holy crap, can I level up? Yeah, I can. Uh... Holy moly, what do we get? What do we get, guys? I didn't plan for level 51, what do I get? While standing still, you can automatically disarm enemies that use melee weapons! Oh my god. Um, is it time to get Aqua Boy? Is it time? Is it time that we get Aqua Boy? I feel crummies, but so delighted to see you stream. Or to see your stream. Oh, well, Jagaz, I'm delighted to see your lovely face. Well, I'm glad you're here. Melly Moore, Doug Andler, Ruby. I'm glad you're all here. I really am. Ah, ah, what do we do? What do we do? I don't really know. Aqua Boy. You, you know what? Let's get it. Aqua Boy. Where is it? I don't even know where it is. Aqua Boy. Endurance. I bet it's endurance. Ah. Jagaz. Can't do it. Look. Can't do it. It's it's like... It's, it's like free away. Can't do it. Can't do it. I can get Strong back. That might make Melimore really happy. But um, I, 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 oh, I, I can't, I can't get Aqua Boy. I'm going to Far Harbor today, so it would be quite useful to be able to get the old uh, Aqua Boy going on. But no, can't do it. <laughs> Investing in uh, endurance, endurance, right? I mean, I do use a lot of chems. You know what, Jay Gaz? Let me meet you halfway. Boom. Done. Free endurance. All for you, Jagaz. All for you. Alright, okay. And let's go sleep. Let's go sleep, because I've done something. We've got to remember that this is survival mode, ladies and gentlemen. Got to remember, this is survival mode. If we don't sleep all the time, we're dead. <laughs> uh. Anyway, how many of you have missed me, then? Go on. I, I need it today. I, I need it. I need I need my ego inflating. How many of you have missed... How, how, go on, be honest. How many of you have missed me so much, guys? Like, how many of you? Please tell me. Like, I want, I want everyone to say, Oh, DJ, we've missed you so much. Oh, Evan Watson. Oh, should I kill him? <laughs> ah, I'm so drunk. Anyway. Mysterious Stranger. Yeah, I could get Mysterious Stranger, couldn't I? I mean, the thing about Mysterious Stranger is um, you only get, like, a, I think it's like a 10 or 15% chance on the first perk. And that ain't too great, really. It's not really great at all. Like, uh... <laughs> uh, I mean, um... Oh, let's see. Has anyone missed me? Jagaz, mostly. Oh, you've been dying for me, Jagaz. You know you have. Uh, Doug Andler, I miss you. Melly Moore, me. Da, 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 da. Very nice. <laughs> but yeah. Um, the, 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 what was I on about? I can't remember what I was on about. But whatever I was about to say, yeah, it's a thing. I love the sound of your voice, DJ. I miss hanging with you guys outside of outside my streams. <sighs> well... I love the sound of my voice too, and I love the sound of yours, Ruby, so I'm glad that we love the sounds of our own voices. Man, it's a good thing. Um, but yeah, I've missed you in my stream, Ruby. I'm glad you were able to find your iPad Mini. Again, I question uh, how you could ever lose something as precious as an iPad, but you know what? That's your life, man. That is your life. If you want to be the guy that loses an iPad, then go ahead, man. Then go ahead. I'm a couple of seconds behind, by the way. You know what? That's a good thing. Like, if you're only a couple of seconds behind, then I'm pretty happy. I need food, by the way, guys. Uh, I also love how none of you have really reacted to me 
just casually murdering some of my my fellow institute friends. Like, what what's up with that, guys? What's up with that? Are you really gonna just let me get away with that? <laughs> I need food. Is the is there any free food in here? Like, can I get some like free crops or something? Is that a thing? I really hope that's a thing. Like, maybe in robotics? No, not robotics. Maybe in the um, the thing with the Harambe's. Yes, the, the the place with the gorillas. You know, I'm loving the murder. All right, good, good, <laughs> good. I'm glad. I'm glad someone noticed my my casual stabbing of certain key individuals. <laughs> I need food, guys. Guys, I need food. Stimpack mentats can't eat those. Well, I can, but they don't. They don't do good. They don't do good things for me, guys. Can't do anything with that. I need food. Advanced systems. That's not foodie. I need. I need food. Bioscience. Yeah. That's not really going to be food either. Stop killing people. <laughs> All right, Doug. I'm sorry. And I suck at finding things. At great at losing things. Me too, man. And no, Melimore is not streaming today. Melimore is enjoying my stream today. I said to her, Melimore, I'm going to stream for you today. Even though it is not Monday, I'm going to stream for you, Melimore. And she was like, that's cool. Yeah, that's all she said, actually. There, there was nothing more to it. There was no like screaming or shouting like I was expecting. She was like, huh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah, because I'm a nice guy. I'd stream for any of you guys. Yeah, but not every day and not at this time. Only special people get that treatment. <laughs> ah, kill them all, Jagaz. One day. I mean, Jagaz, how about this? How about this for my new playthrough? I just kill everybody or everyone that isn't classed as essential. Every time I see some kind of human Quick poke. Maybe I could kill everyone in Diamond City. Oh, wouldn't that be sensational? Just killing everyone in Diamond City? Wouldn't that be the greatest thing? I wonder if I could. I was so excited. <laughs> I know, I'm just playing Melly. I am just playing, my dear, my darling. My darling, Melly Moore. Um, let's see if we've got any food at uh, we're not going to have any food at Hangman's, are we? Whoa, we need free food, guys. We need to get some free food on the go. Am I special, Ruby? You know you're special, big guy. You know you're man. Holy moly, I need free food. Like, like now. And to be quite honest, I don't know where I can get any. Like, if I was smart, I would have, like, planted some melons here at, um old hangman's bay like a, a while ago but your boy is not smart he's not smart at all i'm i'm not uh, oh i have parasites that's a thing holy moly <laughs> it's been a while it's been a while since i felt the pain oh wait no i've got I, I don't even have i don't even have any antibiotics it's all going wrong guys the main question here though ladies and gentlemen is Am I special? Am I special, guys? Am I special? Please, tell me I'm special. I need to know. <laughs> Alright, let's go to Diamond City. Let's sell some crap. We can't go to Hangman's. I don't think we've got any food here. Where the hell is this? Oh, Backstreet Apparel. Holy crap. I, I, I stopped playing the game, like, about a week and a half ago, and already I've forgotten everything. Yes, yay, but am I unbannable? Uh, eh, you get in there, man. You get in there. You get in there, Rubes. You get in there. Very slowly, but you get in there, man. Like, isn't there like an entrance to Hangman's around here? Isn't that a thing? I see Melimore sometimes sneak through these, these alleyways and she gets into Hangman's real easily and I'm like, how'd you do that? I mean, I never ask her. Because I don't want to seem dumb, but... Wait, where am I going? Am I even close to where I want to be? No, I am not. I am not close to where I want to be. It's over here. Right, okay. 
Okay, let's see what we can do right now. I need to get to Diamond City. I need to sell some crap. I need to heal myself. I need to eat everything. I mean, Jay has a suggested Grey Garden. I don't even know where that is. Is it up here? I feel like it's up here. Grey Garden? Grey Garden, where are you? Where are you, Grey Garden? That's Green Top. That's kind of like Grey Garden. Grey Garden. Grey Garden. Obstation? Grey Garden? Eh? Uh? Oh. No. Grey Garden? That's Abernathy. Grey Garden. Ten Pines Bluff. Never actually been there. No, I, I don't know where Grey Garden is. So, we'll we'll head back to Diamond City. We'll, um, we'll, we'll sell some things. And we'll buy some food. And we'll feel good about life again. In fact, we'll buy food that we can grow. We'll start making the most of Hangman's Alley. That's a good plan. We like that, DJ. Let's read me chat like a proper streamer. Proper streamers read chat, don't they? Very much so, DJ. Love heart. Love heart to you. Melimore, Ruby, you're great. Ruby is great. Ruby, DJ, Melimore, J Gaz are unbannable in my stream, so yes, you are really special. Yeah. If you didn't hear that, I just chest thumped. By the way, my mom was listening to stream and was like, oh, He said your name. Oh. Ah. And how did she react to that? Was she like, Ah, uh, he sounds like a nice, charming Englishman. You should, like, totally, like, hug that guy. Was she like that? Was she like, yeah, Melimore, you should hug that guy, because, you know, he seems like a nice guy. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's probably what she said. Hopefully. There might be food in here. Isn't there sometimes food in these things? Uh, no. No, there's no. Okay. Kind of dying here. I don't know where I'm going. That's a real issue. Uh, and I don't want to go through there. Let's go around the other way. Can we go around the other way? I don't even know. Is it this way? I feel like it's this way. We'll get there, guys. We'll get there. I, I, the, the thing is, what you're realizing right now is that I actually know nothing about the game. Uh, for the entirety of the race, I've had my twin brother, Downstop JD, playing the game, and I've just been on microphone just to try and fool you. Uh, I'm actually really bad at this game. I should probably take that. I'm actually really bad at this game, and I'm really showing it right now by being clueless about everything. Alright, DC's up there. Alright, that's good. And this door? Maybe? Yeah? Other side oh, it's chained on the other side. Ugh. Forever lost. You know it, Melimore. You know it. God damn it. <laughs> oh, my lord. Oh, well. But yeah, I wanted to stream today, ladies and gentlemen. I wanted to stream today. I wanted to cheer myself up. I wanted to cheer some other people up. I wanted to kind of get back back into it. Because there's going to be... It, it, we're going to come to Monday. We're going to come to... We're going to come to Monday, like, ladies and gentlemen. And... I'm going to sit back in my chair with my controller, with my headset on, and I turn the stream on, and I'm going to be like, I don't know what I'm doing here. I mean, nothing new there, but I'm going to be like, how do I even stream? What do I say? What do I do? So I thought to myself, you know what? People are going to miss me. People are going to be like, oh my god, DJ streaming, we should go watch. So, yeah, th this is kind of like a refresher course, so to speak. I mean, we're not streaming Fallout on Monday. Sorry for anyone, mainly Jagaz, because she loves Fallout, uh, who who might be upset by that. But um, yeah, uh, we're um, I, I kind of need to learn how to stream again, basically. DJ, I thought I made you happy today at my stream. You did make me happy today, Ruby. You did. You did make me happy. You you made me feel good, bruh. You made me feel good. You always do. Uh, it's just the problem is now I've got parasites inside of me, and that doesn't make me feel good at all. Is there anything I can eat in here? Oh, everyone's sad about the lack of Fallout. I'll still be playing Fallout, Jesus Christ. I'll, I'll be playing Fallout at other times. It's just that it won't be... Ooh, purified water. It just won't be all the time, okay, guys? It won't be all the time. I'm sorry, okay? I'm really, really sorry. I, 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 I need to play other games, guys. There are other games that I need to play. And, uh, yeah, I'm really, really sorry. 
Can I do something with these? Oh, I can look up and down now, can I? Oh, fantastic. Right, I need people, don't I? Ah, that's why these aren't producing, because I don't have people. Ah, right, fair enough, fair enough. So, yeah, I, I need people here, don't I? Don't I, like, need to build, like, a radio thing, uh, which I'm probably not going to be able to build, because, uh, yeah, because I've got, like, nothing. Right, okay. Well, bugger that idea. Let's just sell something, and then we can buy it from uh, Diamond City, and then we can feed ourselves. Other times meaning almost never. J you could not be more wrong. The, the schedule that I'm playing around with is two days Witcher, two days Fallout, and then on occasion, on the weekends, a little bit of late night Fallout. Maybe like Sunday. No, not Sunday. Maybe Saturday. Oh, I don't know. It depends when Melly Moore streams. But uh, something, some kind of like late night end of the week thing where we can just talk about life. Not be too serious, just be nice and casual like I always am in this game. And we could just do like some fun weekend things, right? How about that? Two days Witcher, two days Fallout, and a little bit of late night Fallout on the weekend. What about that, Jagaz? What about that? I mean, I think that sounds pretty good. I I'd quite like that. If I was one of you guys, I would flip and love that. I'd be like, holy crap, DJ. That sounds phenomenal. I mean, sure. I, I love The Witcher. And you've been playing Fallout for an entire month non-stop. But that schedule sounds sexy. Wait, we're being serious now? Of course. Of course I'm being serious, Jagaz Mom. I mean, the break that I have taken... Don't be confused. The break that I've taken isn't necessarily from Fallout. The break that I that I took, like at the end of December, was from streaming. So uh yeah, I'll I'll play Fallout uh in, in the new year. Don't you worry about it. I'll schedule it in. I gotta keep everyone happy, so uh yeah, I'll quite happily schedule it in for you Jagaz. And for anyone else that wants to watch it. It's just that I'm gonna be playing Witcher as well. Hey Murna. <laughs> Murna, please! Buy something from me, you beautiful woman. Odds and ends. Alright, what can you buy from me? Uh, let's see. Oh, Grognax. Why, why are you still in my inventory? Oh, right. Okay. Let's see what we can sell. What about that new game? Ah, of course. So, for everyone that doesn't know, I'm planning on purchasing... Uh, the, the Mass Effect Trilogy. For those of you that don't know, it will include not only Mass Effect 1, but also Mass Effect 2 and Mass Effect 3. Now, I mean, I know that's crazy. I know. I know it's crazy. A trilogy with three games in it, but I, I'm planning on purchasing it because uh, I really want to play it. Now, I, I, I told this idea to Jay Gaz. I said, Jay Gaz, look, Jay. I, I, I don't call her Jay. I, but, but just imagine that I did. I'm like, I'm like Jay, look, I want to do something a little bit different this year. And she's like, what's up, big guy? And I'm like, okay, what about this? Let me throw down for you. I'm like, shall we play some Mass Effect on stream? And she was like, oh my god, bah! And um, genuine, like, a, a really good impression of what happened, by the way. She was, like, jumping around, bouncing off the walls. It was it was crazy. Um, but, yeah, she was like, yeah, 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 I'd, I'd be down for that. Even though Mass Effect Andromeda comes out in, like, March or something. She was, like, super up for it. And so I thought to myself, maybe this is a good idea. Now, since then, I've also learned that... Uh, my arch nemesis, Lady Devon, uh, who Melimore adores, by the way, is also streaming Mass Effect from time to time. And, and it's not really important, really, because Lady Devon has like 32,000 followers whilst I've only got 180. But the fact of the matter is Lady Devon stole my first place from me, and I'm really angry about that. But um, yeah, basically, uh, it, it, basically, people are streaming Mass Effect already, and 
also, Andromeda comes out in March. So I'm like, do I do this? But I feel like I need to anyway. I, I, I feel like I want to. I've seen a bit of Mass Effect, not too much. I don't really know how the fighting works. I don't really know about like the choices that you make. I don't really know like much at all. So it, I'd be going in it like completely blind. But I thought it would be cool. And plus free games as well, like Mass Effect 1. We'd play that for like, you know, three months or however long it is. And then Mass Effect 2. And then, as is standard with a trilogy, uh, Mass Effect 3. And, um, yeah, I, I thought that would be cool. I, I, I thought that would be a cool thing to do. So, uh, what do you guys think? Do you guys want to see Mass Effect from your boy Upstart DJ? Do any of you know what Mass Effect is? I mean, it. I, I don't know. I don't know I, myself. I, 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 I can't really say what it is. <laughs> it's, it's a spacey game. It's got space in it, guys. It's a very spacey game. I wonder if we can steal some food here. What we can. I still want to see Mass Effect. Yeah. Oh well, there you go. There you go. Well, there you go. Well, million more Jagas. They've uh, they've said yes. So um, I probably could have cooked all my food here, couldn't I? I'm a big dum dum. But uh, yeah. I, I, I just thought that would be a cool idea, you know. Like, even if Andromeda's coming out in March or whatever it is, it's fine. It's okay. It's absolutely fine. We can just you know, we can just play it anyway. I bet you don't sell food, do you? Let's see what you have. Feel free to test the grid. You know I'll help you if you need it. Chegas, mom. I always need help. <laughs> Not just with games. Holy crap. I need I need food. I, I need help with everything nowadays. You sell food, don't you, Takahashi? Don't you sell food? Can you can you feed me up? Can you feed me up, Takahashi? Yes. Right. Uh, forty-one. Oh my god. Oh, that's so expensive. Uh, okay. Let's uh, let's buy free. There you go. There you go. There you go. Very nice. Space guns and alien sex. Holy. Holy crap. <laughs> there you go, ladies and gentlemen. For, for that reason alone, there is alien the sex in is Mass Effect. If, you, ev if, you, if you've ever get down and dirty with some kind of alien, yeah. then look. holy moly, now, come watch simple. my Mass One Effect um, don't know we're doing it. Uh, come watch it. I don't even have the game yet, guys. I don't even have the game yet, but come watch it. And we'll we'll plow our way through the universe, going from alien to alien. The more tentacles, the better, by the way. I'm pretty sure my main character is going to be into tentacles, so... Uh, yeah, we'll um, we'll we'll, uh, we'll we'll have some aliens. We'll have some alien sex in Mass Effect, I'm sure. Melly Moore seems very excited for the alien sex. I think that's right up her alley. Holy crap! I can't even afford. I can't even afford to cure my rats. Okay. Wonderful plan. Cheers, Melly Moore. <laughs> my dear Melly Moore. Yep. Alien sex. Oh, there you go. All right. I'm hungry. I'm now less hungry. That's good. Can I get some food from somewhere? You don't see me. Oh, wait, maybe I can buy some from you. Remember, bloodier is better. Do you have food? Oh, you do. Oh, Polly. Oh, Polly, 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 Polly. Oh, pretty Polly. Holy moly, thank you very much. Uh, Mentats, don't need them. Don't need them. Have all of them. There you go. Stick those in your meats, and uh, that would be great. I will have a couple of those. There is one. There is one with some kind of tentacles. <gasps> Tell you what, guys. Tentacles. Holy moly. Sexiest thing ever. Oh. You want to know what really gets up Star DJ going? It's it's tentacles. Oh yes. The the more the merrier. I wake up and I'm like, ugh, if only I had some tentacles wrapped around me keeping me warm. Yep, that, that's, that's old Upstar DJ. Yep, that's, uh, that's the kind of thing he's into. 
Oh, I'm so drunk. Uh, holy crap. I love all this meat that you're giving me. Oh, but I can't afford it. Uh, have a tat? No, don't have a buff tat. Have, have a herbal anodyne. There you go. And another. And another? There you go. Cool. Cheers, Polly. Cheers, babe. Alright, where was that cooking station? It was around here, wasn't it? <gasps> Do you mind? Remove yourself from my cooking station. Do you know who I am? Wait, is that a simp? Have the simps moved in? Oh, they have. Oh, the simps have moved in, guys. Oh, what a future we live in. No more Brotherhood of Steel. Ah, oh, that makes me feel real good about life, guys. That makes me feel real good. Those tin can warriors of evil, all gone. <laughs> all right, I don't need to, uh, need to actually cook anything, do I? Uh, please stop making those comes about C. What? All right. Will do, Doug. Just for you, but big guy. Just, just, just for you, man. What just, just for you. Whatever, whatever you just said, I'm gonna do it. All right. Maybe I didn't need to know that. It's all right, Jay, I guess. It's all right. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It, it has been. You, you can just erase it from your mind. I'm sure. I, I'm, I, I won't. I, I'm sorry, Doug. I'm sorry. I'm sorry if I offended you. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry, Doug. It's okay. Don't worry about it. We're back to fall. Don't worry. I mean, obviously, you may want to avoid a bit of Mass Effect or, or Witcher 3 because those two games are, well, well, let's just say that they're not for young guys. But, um, yeah, uh, that's going to be in the future. Uh, let's talk about, let's talk to Ellie first. Before we go to um, Dunwich Borers and then to uh, Far Harbor, we may as well start the quest off with your girl Ellie, because, well, I mean, that's how you start the quest, isn't it? So, let's go talk to Ellie, and it'll be fine. It shall be fine. Glad you're here. We got a new I also don't know how long I'm going to be streaming for, guys, so uh, please, don't, don't, don't get too excited um, for, for streaming all night. Zombie killer. Hey, I'm whispering you because I don't have much data and I'm not home, but when I get home, I'll clean my room and I should be able to join you before the stream ends. I hope so, zombie killer, even though you heard none of that. Far Harbor. Hate that place. I like to call it Why Fun Harbor. Tell me more. Melly Moore had so much fun there during her streams. Dur during, du during all of her streams, she had a jolly old time during uh, Fun Harbor. Oh man, the fun that she had. Milox, Anglers, Gulpers. Oh, Gulpers. Anyway. I'll remember that the next time you need me to console a hysterical client. Mr. Nakano didn't Did he go over everything when you meet him? But if you want my guess, missing person case. Guy had a worried look a mile long. Okay, don't worry about it. I'll go check it out. I'm on it. Thanks, Ellie. The Nakano residence is up in the northeast, near the coast. A small fishing house. He said that he and his wife will be waiting for you. It's Brilliant. a long walk. <laughs> that's how the hard cases always start. Well, that's okay. I don't mind a long, hard walk. Um, I mean, I'd love to sleep in this bed. Can I sleep in a bed? Can I sleep in this bed? I can't sleep in this bed. Can I steal this? No, I can just take it. Oh, even better. Oh, even better. I can just take it. Oh, guys, I can just take it. Nick, I'm not taking all of your food, even though I'm pretty sure you don't eat. Because, well, I don't know if you know this, but you're some kind of weird robot monster. Uh, anything else I can steal? Can I steal some more food? Pretend like I'm not here. Area is pretty isolated. I don't know why you're talking to me, Ellie. I'm not here. Mr. Nakano and Nick. Yeah, yeah, that's a thing. But you know, I'm I'm not here. It's a Finch case file. The Marty Bullfinch case. Marty was Nick's partner. Emphasis on the was. Ah, I remember that quest. We'll do that in the future as well. Hey, that place still stuck there. Oh, of course you went back, didn't you? Um, I'm pretty sure you took Ellie's dinner. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, it's okay. It's better in me than in her. Oh, oh wait, is it? Oh, 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 I forgot. Oh, 
Oh, sweet salvation. Sweet salvation. Holy moly. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Oh, you boy. Oh, I'm having all of this. Oh, man. Okay. I don't know how, uh, you know, good potatoes are in, in the grand scheme of things, but uh, I'll take some. Oh, and muck fruit. Oh, and so, muck fruit. The synths are just walking among us now. Yeah, synths are cool. Get used to it, you nerd. What would you rather have? Brotherhood of Steel soldiers bumping into you with a big old Brotherhood of Steel awful armor stuff? Yeah. Yeah, you don't want that. No one wants that. They want sexy simps. Uh, apologies for saying that, Doug Andler. But still, it's, it's true. What is your favorite food? Cake. Always cake, guys. Cake. Any kind of cake. Unless it's like fruit cake. Holy crap. Ugh. I'm not going to lie, guys. Fruitcake, awful. Especially English fruitcake. I don't know about you guys, but when English folk make fruitcake, it's more fruit than cake. And that really frustrates me. They, like, holy moly. No one wants to eat that much fruit. Like, like dried fruit especially. Ooh. Oh, God. Right. Uh, we're going to take a trip to... No, we'll just save here. Do we have the money to save here? Ah, we'll just save it, Hangman's. It'll be fine. We can Radex, right? Yeah. Oh, cheesecake. Oh, cheesecake. Holy moly. Cheesecake is phenomenal. Holy moly. Big fan. Big fan of the old cheesecake. I, I, should, I should make a cheesecake. I should make a cheesecake. Cheesecake is, like, one of the easiest things to make. And I'm, like, in love with it. And yet, I've not had it for flipping ages. Ad Victorian. No. No. Well, I've none of that. <laughs> this is a, a Brotherhood free stream. But yes. Uh, it's, it's okay. Brotherhood of Steel, guys, you can come in here. But yeah, basically, cake. Apart from fruitcake. Fruitcake is the devil. Any other kind of cake, even cheesecake, which isn't really... Is it really a... Is it, is it really a cake? I, I, I don't even know if you would actually call it a cake. But it's okay. I still love it. I still love it, guys. I I mean, if, if any of you have any more questions, I, I I'm I'm feeling pretty pretty open tonight. Feel free to throw around any questions. I don't mind. I mean, it's not going to be the most exciting. Ask me anything, because there's like only three people here or four people or whatever. But you know, feel free to ask me anything, and uh, I will do my best to answer. Favorite food? Cake. There you go. That's what you've learned about. Upstart DJ so far. Oh, and his love for um, tentacles. Yeah, big fan of the old tentacles. Right. So I'm pretty sure I've unlocked Dunwich Borers. If I haven't, then that is a problem. I think it's somewhere around. I guess it would be somewhere around here. Do you like memes? Holy crap. Yes. Although. I know, I know very little about memes. Memes are amazing, and yet they seem to just pass me by. Everyone's like, "Yo, DJ, I got this sick hot hot meme for you," and I'm like, "Holy crap! How did I miss this dankness?" And yet, you know, I still love him anyway. So, butt hurt pony, I'm I'm into that meme business. You can't vertibird anymore, right? I can't. We're going on a road trip, guys. Big old road trip. <sighs> right. Uh, why did you start screaming? What? Do you, screaming? Do you actually mean screaming? Do, have you watched me sli like sleep? Because I, I scream in my sleep all the time. It, it's, a, it, it's a psychological issue. Uh, I just scream every time I fall asleep. I'm pretty sure you mean streaming, but... Uh, Unless you genuinely mean, why did I start screaming? I don't exactly remember the last time I screamed. Am I even capable of screaming? I don't know, Doug Andler. But unless you mean... If you mean streaming, why did I start? Ah, God. Well, okay. Alright. Story time. Let me talk to you guys. Let me talk to you. So, um... Last Christmas. Last Christmas was pretty bad. For the old, for old upstart DJ, uh, I was I was in a pretty bad shape. I, I was I was in an awful shape really. I was just getting out of a very long depression, which I'd suffered for years, pretty much 
pretty much is, actually. Uh, no exaggeration whatsoever. Uh, oh, oh, that was interesting. And um, uh, me and my mother, uh, we we both had a bad Christmas. My mother, she broke up. With, well, she, she didn't break up with a boy. Well, she did break up with a boyfriend, but actually. Uh, she found her, her boyfriend cheating on her, so she had a, a really awful Christmas. And I was having an awful Christmas just because uh, I was feeling low, guys. I was feeling really low. So, January came. January came of 2016. And uh, I said to myself, I'd like this year to be different somehow. I, I'd, like, I'd like to change things. I and I mean I had to change things anyway. I need to like get into work. I need to actually start earning some money, start living some kind of life, which I've achieved a little bit, I'm surviving off what little money I get each year. Well, each day, sorry. But um, yeah, I needed to like change something. So uh, I got myself an Xbox One uh, in Christmas of 2015. So I thought to myself in January 2016, why not try streaming? Why, why, why not try it? Like, I've been given this opportunity. My life has basically been, oh, you, you've not had any opportunities, DJ. You, you just gotta, gotta live your life uh, without any kind of help or whatever. But, but, but I've been given this opportunity because I had this console that was capable of streaming. And I used to love YouTube. I, I used to do a lot of YouTube. So I thought to myself, why not? Why not try it? And I was thinking, why not try it for about a month? Because uh, I only started streaming in February, February 12th. And uh, I just f said to myself, you know what? I don't know how long this streaming adventure will, 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 will last. It could end in a, like a month or so. It, I might not even like it, but I said to myself, all right, let's try it. Let's try it. If we like it, great. If we get on, great. If not, though, no pressure. Walk away. It's fine. It's okay, and um, I tried it. Tried it in February. I uh, I got enough courage to start playing a game that I knew a little bit about, Tomb Raider: Definitive Edition, and uh, yeah, I, I got I got used to it. Like when I first started streaming, uh, I was basically alone for like I think it was two weeks. I think it took me two weeks to get someone to say hello to me, which is. Um, it's a shame. It's a shame, really. But what I liked about that time period, that kind of lonely time period, is that I could just talk to myself. I could talk to myself, and that kind of got me into my streaming style. Because I feel like everyone needs a streaming style. I need some people need to be able to kind of project their own style onto a stream. And my style back in the day. And I still like to think that it is, is the old Let's Play style. The the whole kind of educate people, be informative about the game, have a good laugh at the game, but you know, mainly focus on the video game. And for the longest time, that's what I did. And that's what I did with Tomb Raider. So I just had fun with the game, but I tried to educate as well, show some tips and tricks from what, from what I've uh, learned and all that. Uh, and I enjoyed it. And then... I got my first viewer, a chap named Ewan Patterson, who I've not seen since, but he is my first follower ever. And everyone remembers their first. Lol. And Ewan Patterson was like, hi. And I was like, oh my god, what do I do now? I was there talking about lovely Lara Croft, how pretty she was and how amazing she was and how much, she, how much of a bad day she was having by falling down cliffs and getting stabbed by... You, you know, random dudes and whatnot. And then suddenly, Ewan Patterson walks into my stream and he's like, Hi! Oh. I'm like, oh my god, okay. And so I just started talking to him. And it felt natural. It felt natural to me. It, it felt like I could do it. I needed that hello. Like, that hello was, hello was so important to me. I mean, the reason why I go on about people just looking for little streamers and engaging in the, you know, in in the stream, I, I go on about it because that hello saved my life pretty much. Like, if I hadn't had the stream throughout 2016, I genuinely don't know where I would be right now, and it's a scary thought. It really is. But that simple hello from you and Patterson kind of told me that I could do this. 
that I could have a stream schedule, that I could make friends, that I could have a community, and that I, I am worth something to this world. It was in January, like, 2016, I didn't believe that I was worth anything to anyone. And it's sad to say, I know, I'm not actually kind of looking for awes and sympathy or whatever, it's just, it's just is what it is, but that, that hello from you and Patterson kind of started it all off. Jay guys, my first follower was my husband. Aww. Well, I mean, my husband, I've not seen him for years, so he, he couldn't follow me, sadly, but uh, thankfully Ewan Patterson was there. But yeah, Ewan Patterson, my first ever follower, he came back to pretty much every stream. He seemed to enjoy it. Didn't laugh very much, but uh, with, with sex, but he seemed to enjoy it. He was like, oh, I love this game. Oh, you're so funny. Oh, you should have more followers. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, I'd, I'd like more followers. Um, and yeah, since that day, I, I've been streaming. And I'd like to be able to stream forever. I'm still under the mindset that one day, for some reason, I won't be able to stream. Like, I don't know. Oh, God. Wow, you kind of kind of missed your target there, Simpy boy. I ain't the enemy. But yeah, uh, I'm still under the mindset that one day, maybe, something will take this stream away from me for whatever reason. Maybe, uh, what the hell is that? Maybe, um, I don't know, maybe I'll fall back into depression again. Maybe I'll just find work. Maybe, you know, proper work. I mean, I'm looking for proper work right now. I'm, I'm job hunting right now, but I don't know, maybe one day, the stream will like get taken away from me by life because that always seems to happen you know you get something good going on in life or in my life anyway and something always seems to take it away but um till now i've been incredibly happy i've met some wonderful friends some beautiful lovely people jay guys melly Moore. i mean i love you guys doug andler i mean doug andler you funded my my fallout 4 dlc playthroughs uh ruby minor you know just everyone and that loads of nice people, loads of beautiful experiences, and uh, I'm ever so grateful. And I hope that nothing ever takes this stream away from me, but uh, just just how it starts life works, unfortunately. What's this, by the way? Wait, what? Uh, what? What's this? But yeah, um, basically that's, uh, that, I hope that answers your question, Doug Andler. Sorry, it was all ranty. <laughs> what is that? I, I mean, if it said open, I'd be okay with it. But detonate? No, 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 no. I need some advice. About four minutes of a video I'm editing has glitched up audio and graphics. Should I keep it in or edit it out? What do you mean by glitched exactly? Do you mean desync or or what? Like what exactly is the issue? I mean if it is something like desync where you've recorded your audio and your your visuals on or oh, sorry your game like together uh, on the same kind of track and for some reason your audio sorry your visual is glitched and your audio has gone on the head and it's caused that desync then to be honest, that's going to just cause issues. Uh, I mean, it also depends on how important those four minutes are as well. So, first of all, what do you mean by glitched? And second of all, how important are those four minutes? Tell me that. Tell me that, Jagaz, and I'll give you an answer. Oh, dear. But yeah, there you go. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. There's my story. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. If not, if I put you all to sleep thanks to my little stream story, then I'm sorry, okay? Like there's a multicolor pattern that show up, a uh, multicolor pattern that show up randomly. Uh, is it really annoying? Like, is is it? Does it kind of obscure the the visuals, like horribly, or is it just like every few seconds? Every like 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 how bad is it? In your opinion, how how bad is it? Again, um, I I need to know. I'm trying to imagine it in my mind. I assume this is Fallout stuff, right? So, uh, yeah. Tell me that. It's annoying to me. Right, okay. 
Well, what I used to do, if there was ever like an important part of a video that messed up for me, how many followers do you have? 182, I think. Can't quite remember, but welcome to the stream, goalkeeper. Um, if there was ever an issue with one of my YouTube videos and it was an important part that I lost, uh, say it's 185. Oh, cigar smoke! Oh, cigar smoke. Big hugs for cigar smoke. Mm. Cigar, I love you, man. Welcome to the stream, good sir. Hopefully your, hopefully your Christmas has been merry, or whatever you celebrate. But yeah, Jay guys, back to you. I apologize. Um, yeah, so if any of my videos kind of glitched out and it was an important part, then what I would do is I would throw up an annotation saying, uh, sorry for the issue with this part, but it did have some relevance, and so I've kept it in, but I will fix any issues next time. Now, if you said it's at the start of the episode, so if the start of the episode isn't too important, if the only thing you're losing is, say, your intro and just a little bit of prep work, I'd say cut it out and then throw in an annotation in the video saying something like, okay, um, you've missed out on me scrapping things or putting stuff back at Sanctuary or whatever. Just kind of make sure that the viewer knows that this th there, there was an issue, but it, it's fine. You've not missed anything. I'm too lazy for annotations. Annotations are the easiest thing. It would be easier for you to put an annotation in than to edit the glitched thing out. So I don't believe that. <laughs> do you want me to do it for you, Jagaz? Give me your YouTube login and I will do it for you. Oh, God. Why do I have 185 followers? I thought I had 182. Let me check. Right, so I had 183 at the start of the night. Who's followed? Who's followed me? If only I had Moobot. He'd tell me. But I don't, because I'm dumb. Well, whoever's followed me tonight, thank you very much. I love you guys for following me. Um, I, I don't know why you followed me, but for whatever reason, I, I, I hope it's a good reason, and I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad that you chose to follow Upstart DJ. I'm glad that I streamed tonight now. I've already got two followers. Holy moly, Mellymore, what a great idea I had. Oh. I mean, I'm not going to lie to you guys. Like, I, I wasn't going to stream tonight. I wasn't going to stream tonight. But, um, I was talking to Mellymore, and I was like, hey, I want to I wanna, I wanna make you happy. Should I stream for you? And she was like, yeah, go on then. And so that's why I'm here. But if I'm going to get followers as well, that's incredible, and I love it. I also got to look- I've got to love this sandwich that I'm in. Mongrel and st Mongrels and Stingwings. Let's kill something. I feel like I've not killed something for, well, since um, the old Institute, guys. So let's see what we can do here. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh! Bang! There you go. Danger? We're good. Let's eat these. There you go. That's good eating that. Dogs are good eating. Tice! Sneeze! Whatever you prefer to be called. I love calling you Tice. I'm so sorry. Uh, Sneeze, welcome to the stream, my good sir. Welcome to the stream. How are you tonight? Oh, ha. Ha. The tastiest of meat. Ha 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 ha. I'll be no stack. I come for you. I come for your flesh. Oh yeah. Oh, you don't even know. You're having dreams of frolicking in a meadow, aren't you? <gasps> Thinking of better times, aren't you? <gasps> oh, oh, what a oh, what a glorious dream you're having. I almost sang there, I apologize. Boom! Oh, oh yeah. I'm gonna eat all of you. Mmm, baby. Alright, there you go. I don't mind DJ, both is fine. Okay, Tice just makes me sound smarter, you know. Because, like, when people look at the name Tice, like T-H-I-J-S, they're like, is it, is it Fidge? Is that how you pronounce it? Fidges? Fidge? But I know it's Tice, so it makes me feel clever. So, yeah, I, I will do it from time to time. Mongrel and Stingwing Sandwich. Yeah, doesn't that sound tasty? With a little bit of Eddie in the middle? <laughs> Sounds delicious. Oh, God. 
But yeah, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for joining my stream tonight. Oh my god. I'm still buzzing from seeing cigar smoke in my stream, to be honest with you. Holy moly. I love cigar smoke. Let me tell you, I, I, I found... Well, cigar smoke joined my stream when I was playing Dark Souls. And I'm, I don't think any of you were here for Dark Souls. I don't think I knew Melimore back, at, back in Dark Souls. I don't even know if I knew, knew Jagas back in Dark Souls. So, like... Cigar... Ha! Oh, oh. Ha! Cigar Smoke represents one of my, my old school kind of posse. And I, I, I love it. Do you know what else I love? I love the big ladies, guys. I love the big ladies. And you don't get bigger than a My Alert Queen. Come here, baby girl. Come here. I got a little something for you. Ah, oh, yeah. You want, you want some of this? You want some of old Eddie? Oh, oh, what are you fighting? Are you fighting something, big girl? Oh, let me, let me come in. Let me come in and, uh, show you some, uh, some, some, some loving right now. No, didn't know you, uh, no Dark Souls was a thing. Yeah, I used to play Dark Souls on stream, guys. Anyone interested in Dark Souls, apart from Cigar Smoke? No? Good, because I'm not very good at it. In fact, no, that's a lie. I'm really good at Dark Souls. That's the problem. <laughs> it's like the best game I'm... It's like the game I'm good at. The only game I'm good at. And I don't enjoy it, like, at all. Holy crap. Okay. We got a problem here. Because Blitz doesn't like elevation. But Eddie Cuts loves rat snakes. Ah, yeah. Oh, baby girl. Come to me right now. Uh, let me show you a good time. Uh, here you go. Wapa! There you go. That's the good stuff. I'm talking dirty to a mile at Queen. You know it. You know it, man. You know it. But not too dirty, because I don't want to offend anybody with with dirty talk all night. <laughs> ah, I'm gonna eat her up. Holy crap. Oh start DJ, twenty seventeen. Right, let's uh let's continue to Dunwich Boris. Where are we? Wait, what? Wow! Okay, we totally missed the mark. Okay. Fantastic. Uh, holy crap. Uh, let's see. What have you guys been saying? Mahaha. <laughs> Doug Antler's laughing. Our time frame don't match well. I know, Cigar. It's fine. Don't worry about it, big guy. No, didn't know Dark Souls was a thing. Yeah, it was back in the day. Now nah, Fallout brought me to you. Yeah, good old Covenant. Ties, talking dirt to a Milo Queen, that's, how, that's what we do here. If it wasn't 20 below uh, wind chills, I would still be working. Oh, God, Cigar, that sounds awful, mate. I'm so sorry. Uh, Doug, what was it like whenever I got here? What was it like whenever I... It, 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 was, it was tentacle... Wait, what? I, I don't even know, Doug. Jagaz, too bad she didn't have more tentacles for you. <laughs> yeah... Yeah, old upstart DJ giving up all the secrets. Ah. Yep, upstart DJ loves those tentacles, guys. If anyone ever meets me for real, then um, I, I want you to buy some kind of, I don't know, tentacle glove thing which hides your, your arm so you can just hug me with tentacles. <laughs> oh, dear. I'm not drunk. I promise you, I'm not drunk. Alright, okay, um, but yeah, there you go, ladies and gentlemen, there you go. Um, I, I used to play Dark Souls. That's the, that's the gist of what I was j just been talking about for 30 minutes. I used to play Dark Souls. And I'm never going to play it again on stream, so if any of you actually wants me to play Dark Souls, tough. Because, uh, I, I, I don't want to. I don't want to, guys. I don't want to. I don't want to play Outlast either, before anyone makes me play that, so, uh, yeah, that's not happening. Alright, it's kind of lucky that we found this place, because this place has got beds. And no death claws. Did I cure my parasites? Yeah, I did, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Alright, good. I was about to say, I, I don't want parasites. There's, sl there's a sleeping bag here, but I feel like there's a proper bed around here. No, just a mattress, but... that. Oh, oh hello. Mattress is fine. Uh, right, what, what are we doing? What are we doing? There you go. There you go. That's the big stuff. Sweet. 
<laughs> right sat down. Yeah, stick it on the list, guys. Stick it on the list, Melee Boy. Oh, oh, baby. I don't want that. I don't want that either. Oh, God, why'd you stick all the junk? Flipping mask chest. Saying that, I don't even know what I'd want from a chest anymore. I, c I come to these chests, chests right now. And I'm like, oh, it's a master one. It must have amazing things in it. And yet, oh, I genuinely, oh, ah, hello. I genuinely don't know what I'd want from a master chest. Like maybe food? Like a chest full of food, that might be good. Oh, puncturing pipe wrench. Carrying too much? That's amazing. Uh, I, I, I guess we could take a look at it. Um. Cool. But no. Ah, uh, right. Uh, but but yeah, I don't know what I want from these chests anymore. Like. Oh, you know what, guys? I'm just gonna like stop talking and uh, try and sneak my. Oh, hello. How you doing? You're dead. Uh, I'm just gonna try and get out of here, you know. Oh God. Yeah, I see you. I see you. I see you trying to... Oh, it's a legendary. Whoa! Legendary! Alright, no one else see me, please? Ah, oh, thank you. A crippling, overcharged plasma scattergun. Ooh, baby. Oh, dang. Wait six for 700 big ones? Oh, my lord. Don't mind if I do. Oh, baby. How long are you streaming? The hotel fridge is about out of beer. Um, pass. For as long as I can, my dear cigar smoke. So, uh, yeah, you may go do what you wish. Go get some beer, and uh, hopefully I'll still be streaming. I should be. I, sh I should be. Let's, let's just stream all night, guys. Should we just stream all night? Let's stream all night. Yeah, there you go. I'm going to be streaming until 9 a.m. in the morning. How about that? No oh, wait, no, I can't. I'm I'm busy on Friday. Ugh. Uh, I'll be streaming for a couple of hours anyway. Cigar smoke. <laughs> I'll be streaming for a little bit. Uh, am I hungry? I am indeed. I'm starving. I should probably cook this meat. I really should probably cook this meat. That would probably help. Let's not eat the meat. Let's eat. Mel no, not melon. Let's eat. Mutt fruit. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. That's the good stuff. Oh, yeah. There you go. Alright, cool. Am I still overweight? I am by one. Ugh! Oh, heartbreak. Yeah, sorry. I, I would stream all night. I, I would genuinely stream all night. If you believe that, then you believe anything. But, um, unfortunately, I can't. I am I'm quite busy on the Friday, sadly. Why do... Why am I carrying a, a high-powered magnet? Oh my god! I'm I, I'm very I'm very busy on on the Friday, the fridge are. Um, so uh, yeah, uh, unfortunately, will not be streaming all night. However, that's okay. You already cut my feels with the the, the Dark Souls hate. Oh, cigar smoke, cigar smoke! I actually love you so much that I would stream Dark Souls for you again. Like, and Zombie Killer, actually. Zombie Killer's not here, but he loved the Dark Souls. So, I... I, I mean, okay, look. Let, let, me, let, me, let, me, let me talk to you guys. Okay. See, look. The thing about me in Dark Souls is that I don't really like games that are dark. And I don't mean dark as in nighttime or pitch black. I'm talking dark as in, like, weird and twisted. You know, so like, um, all the creepy things. I mean, I've already admitted that I'd love tentacles, but, you know, the dark kind of creepy things. And so, things like Quaylag. For those of you that don't know who Quaylag is, Quaylag is a boss in Dark Souls who is basically half-naked lady, half-spider. And she spits out lava, and she lives in a horrible place called Blight Town. And I, I don't like that kind of thing. I, I, I don't like it at all. But, I have uber respect for the game. Um, I feel like what the game has done, I, I feel like what they've done with the game is incredible. 
I think that it's interesting, kinda? I don't really like the story of Dark Souls, but I think that the lore is kind of interesting. And I think that the fighting, as difficult as it is, for me anyway, I mean, I say that I'm good at the game, and I am, but I'm still, like, I still get my ass kicked. Uh, it, it, it's good. It's good fighting. It, it's really good fighting. And so, you think Fallout isn't dark? <sighs> Not as dark as Dark Souls, no. Um, but yeah, uh, basically, it's that kind of weird... Oh, hello. Ha, oh, 5 and 0, guys. Time for 5 and 0. But yeah, basically, um, that's kind of why I don't really enjoy it. It's all very strange, all very spooky, and it intimidates me, basically. Now, I learned how to be good at Dark Souls, thanks to my friend, who, uh, who gave me all the big tips and tricks. My boy clone, who I talk about from time to time, he's excellent at Dark Souls. He flippin' loves it. If he was here right now, he'd be like, yeah, I'm amazing at Dark Souls. And, and he taught me everything that I know, and then I took that knowledge, and I actually performed really well at the game. I completed it on New Game Plus One, on my own. Which is probably nothing to anyone else, but for me, that's actually, that's actually really good. But, uh, I don't know, between the tough fighting and the weirdness, nah, I, I don't really enjoy it. But I definitely don't hate it, Cigar. I don't hate it, so, yeah. Um, now, if someone is ever going, if someone, like, donates more Dark Souls games, then, one, I'd probably be very, very sad, but two, I probably would still play them. Uh, for you guys, but... Uh, I, 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 at the same time, I'd be like, ugh, I wish I was playing Mario Galaxy or something. <laughs> just, just let me play Pokemon, guys. Let me play Pokemon. So yeah, me and Dark Souls, it, it's a love-hate relationship. But Cigar Smoke with you, it's all love, guy. It, it's all love, man. So, yeah. As long as... as, as I, I, hope, I, hope that, I hope that makes you happy. But would you stream it all night? What, Dark Souls or Mario Galaxy? I would stream... I would stream Mario Galaxy all night. Holy moly. I'd get all 120 shines or... Like, sorry, stars? Stars, isn't it? Or whatever. Dark Souls all night? Nah. I mean, the thing about me and Dark Souls, again, is that I can complete it in five hours. Then that's not really using top speedrun strats. I, I can complete it in about five hours, so I would not stream it all night, no. I'd be like, yep, Gwyn's done. Done. Bedtime. Oh. Uh. <laughs> okay. Uh. Hey, Melly, it happened to me as well. I'm seeing things. I'm seeing things. Where are they? Uh. Uh, but yeah, um, I wouldn't stream Dark Souls all night now. Should I pickpocket this? See what happens? <laughs> what? What? Um. Oh, I love this game so much. Holy moly. <laughs> uh, but yeah, uh, oh, I tr tried Fallout and couldn't get into it. I mean, that's okay. That's alright, cigar, cigar Smoke. The thing about video games, ladies and gentlemen, is that it is each to their own. Everyone loves their own little video games. Everyone loves their video games in their own little way. Like, when you... When you fall in love with a streamer like me, and I know that you all love me, and and don't don't you try and deny it, but when you fall in love with a streamer like Upstart DJ, you kind of fall in love with the game that he's initially playing, but then you've got to realise that he's also going to play other games as well, and uh, and that's that's a shame for some people because, oh. Oh, there you are. Uh, and that's a shame for some people. Because I, I mean, someone like Jagaz's mom, for instance, who joined me for Fallout, 
she would probably love me to play Fallout for the rest of time. I think that she probably would. She'd be like, yo, DJ, because she's gangster, sit your ass down and play Fallout for me. 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, until your eyes bleed from all of that Fallout action. But that, that's just simply, that just simply can't happen. Because I want to play the games that I want to play as well. And so, I, 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 I mean, I, I'd love to play Dark Souls like, all the time. I'd love to play Fallout all the time. But unfortunately, I got other stuff to do. Like The Witcher, for instance. Which is a very good game. Not that Jagas would agree. Other games like The Awful Witcher 3. Quite right. Doug Handler, Poop Quiz, 2 plus 1, uh, 21. 21. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, I mean, I'm going to be playing The Witcher 3 again in, uh, on Monday. This coming Monday. And I know that Jagas' mom is like, eh, I'm not a fan. But that's okay. Because, uh, oh, can't go that way. Oh, is it over here? It's over here. I know she's not a fan, but that's okay. Because um, I know that uh, she'll always come back for my little Fallout streams and all that. Where am I going right now? Am I... I I'm going the right way, right? I think I am. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What other games do you like playing? Uh, well, and currently... my my cur The current games that I'm playing that are streamable, but I'm not really streaming, are Overwatch, uh, Gwent. I play a lot of Gwent. Sleeping Dogs. Sleeping Dogs is like my second favorite game ever. Holy crap, I love that game. Um, obviously Fallout, uh, Witcher, I, I do, I stream the, both of those games. Uh, what else am I playing? I'd like to stream Pokemon Sun, to be perfectly honest with you, but uh, I don't have the technology. I'm a fan of DJ. Oh, Jagas, you are absolutely lovely. Lovely lady that you are. I love you. And I know what Jagaz's mom looks like now, guys. <laughs> Man, she is a beauty. Oh, my God. Right. Uh, but, yeah. What else what is everyone else saying? Bought Witcher 3. Uh, bought Witcher 3, but had to finish Dark Souls 2 first. Right. I mean, uh, that that's fine. Uh, uh, Dark Souls 2 is considerably shorter than The Witcher 3. So, I would suggest finishing Dark Souls 2 first. I mean, Cigar Smoke, how are you enjoying Dark Souls 2 so far? Are you getting through it? What boss did you kill last? Please tell me. I'd love to know. Aren't we all cool? You are all cool. I think I'm probably the least cool person here, to be perfectly honest with you. I mean, when you've got, like, such lovely people like Melimore and and uh, Jay Gaz and, and Doug and Cigar and Ruby and everyone around, you know? Are these actually carrots? No, it's just carrot flower. God damn it. Um, yeah, I, I'm probably the least cool person here. Okay, off to get beer back in 10. Alright, Cigar Smoke. Be safe, my good friend. Be safe. And I'll see you later, good sir. Damn it! But yeah. Oh, God. What was that? I was looking away for a second. Nah, you are cool. Tice. I know you're listening you made me believe, man. End. Thank Where you. You give she? me hope. Where you give me daughter? hope, good sir. Kenji, please. Ding dong! Stop. I'm here for dinner. She's out. What? Who are you? Who are you? I'm sorry, but we don't have time. I'm gonna take a drink of water. Caravans or wherever you're from. Oh, you killed the scorpion quail, like ah, uh, oh, what's his name? Nashka. Was it Nashka? Can't quite remember. All right, you go get your beer. You go get your beer, man. You are the coolest DJ. Thank you, Doug Andler. Doug Andler, by the way. Holy moly. Guys, let me tell you. Doug Andler sent me an Xbox Live message, like, I think a week ago now or something. And it was the kindest, sweetest message ever. He was like, like, I, I, I didn't watch many streams before you, and I watched you, and you made me feel welcome, and you're like the nicest person, and you're like the best streamer I watch, and it was the nicest thing ever. So, Doug Andler, I love you, man. I love you. you you're the coolest guy, man. Uh. Ah, apologies. I just had to get that out. I love my viewers. Gotta do it. Right, I'm from Valentine's. I'm with Valentine's Detective Agency. You asked for help? Oh, thank God. You have to get working right away. Right. Okay. 
So, what's the story with you and Nick? That is not important. Still right as charismatic as a dead fish, unfortunately, old Eddie. Okay, I'm here to help. help. Tell me what happened. It's all thanks to this damn radio. Our daughter Kasumi likes to fix things. The radio was her latest project. Until she made contact with some kidnapper who lured oh her away God. from us. Well, oh, Kasumi, what are you home. doing? She's not a child anymore. Our daughter is 19. She yeah? knows how to survive, and she's capable. <sighs> I think maybe she left because she wanted her... That was actually the most no, tuneful sigh I've ever done in my life. She would have said <laughs> something. I know my daughter is in danger. Can I get to rummaging through her, her things Find right her, now, please? please? I will. Ask for money. Let's talk money. Investigations for the missing aren't cheap. I am not going to bother over wow. my daughter's I, life. I can't Your chime anybody. Going to be 300 caps. Take it or leave it. If your charisma is high, you can make so much caps on Far Harbor. Awesome. Well, Tice, no unfortunately, Thank big you. guy. I ain't upstairs, got no charisma. <laughs> I think I'm on two. And two charisma doesn't buy you much, unfortunately. Oh, man. Like, I, I was sad because I was watching Jagaz play Fallout on her stream. And she was like, Idiot Savant, 10 charisma or high charisma equals a lot of experience. And she was just cashing it in. Holy crap. She was hitting every charisma check and getting Idiot Savant as well. She was basically getting experience for talking. And I was like, oh, oh you're, you're such a genius, Jagaz. Why didn't I think of that? And instead, your boy DJ, unfortunately, for the old... One charisma, now two, thanks to a bobblehead. So, uh, yeah. Smart guy. <laughs> Eddie has the charisma of a snail. I, I think even snails have more charisma. Is my game fixed, by the way? Oh, it is! Oh, guys! Oh, oh, oh. It's like a, it's like a brand new game. A whole new world. Oh, I can look up and down. Oh, I love this game. Right, uh... I'm parched from water. Need water, guys. Is there a bed around here? Do we have a bed? Now, I must apologize to my dear and lovely friend, Miss Mellymore, because I did say to her that I'd go and get Krem's tooth. Problem is, I've completely bypassed it. And so, now, I'm at a bit of an impasse. Do I... Do I go back and get Krem's tooth? Or do we start Far Harbor? I will leave that to you guys. Should I go to Dunwich Boras and try and get myself a legendary, cool, unique weapon? Or should I go to Far Harbor right now? Place your bets. What would you guys like to see right now? Please, let me know. Yep, keep singing. Ah, <laughs> oh, but I'm so bad at it. Can I steal your food? Uh, Braxo Cleaner, that's not food. Oh, God. Yeah, what would you guys like me to do? You, probably, you guys probably want me to sing, don't you? Is that it now? Far Harbor? Far Harbor? Mellymore? Are you okay with me playing Far Harbor? Far Harbor from Tice? Oh. Mellymore, if you said go to Dunwich Boras, I'd do it. That's how, that's how much influence you have right now. I'd do it. So, um, yeah. Votes with you. Although she seems quiet tonight. Maybe she's chilling out. But yeah, we'll go Far Harbor. We'll do Far harbor things. Alright, what do we do? Mr. Nakano. Do you have questions? About yes, I do have questions. Such as uh her radio. Tell me more about this radio she was fixing. I've tried to get the damn thing to I don't even know how to start over. Far Harbor. Do I listen to the tapes? I think I that I do, just right? I wanted to strip it for parts or build a toaster out of it or something like she usually does. Someone made contact with her and then they took her. God, what kind of twisted psychopath has my daughter? You know what? You know what? Guys? No more questions right I'm now. I'm actually going to overrule all of you. Detective. I'm actually going to overrule all of you. See, the problem is... If I go to Far Harbor right now, I ain't coming back for a little while. And so... All of the quests that I'd want to do in the Commonwealth, I ain't doing them for a little bit. That's the issue right here. Whereas, if I do Dunwich Boras now, get Crown's Tooth, get out of there, and then go do Far Harbor... Everyone's happy. So I'm, I actually think I'm going to overrule every single last one of you. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm going to do it. 
I'm gonna do it. The Carnos, hold on tight. I'll find your daughter. Right, I need to know where Crone's Tooth is. I need to know where Dunwich Bore is, is, guys. If any of you can throw me a map in whispers, I would love you forever. I think it's somewhere around here. It makes sense to me, guys. I'm sorry, I know you're all here for perhaps a little bit of Far Harbor action, but I, I want to do this so badly. I want to find out where the Sneak Bobblehead is. I want to see how cool Krem's Tooth is. And if I don't do it now, I'm not going to be doing it for months because Far Harbor is going to take me a long, long time. So, consider yourselves overruled, ladies and gentlemen. But, um, yeah. Oh, mutiny. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Doug Adler, my game attack says Melimore. Go to Far Harbor. <sighs> ah, Doug Adler. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. Come. I don't believe you, man. I don't believe you. I mean, I'm sure your voice is a. I'm sure your voice is beautiful. And I'm sure you're as lovely. But, um, there's only one Melimore. And so, uh, yeah. Um, I'm gonna have to say no to that one, Doug. But yeah, apologies. I just, I, I really want to find Krem's Tooth. I said at the start of the game, the start of this kind of race, I want to find it. I want to go to Dunwich Borers and I want to find it. So I think we're going to do it. I think we're going to do it. The problem is, I don't know where it is. So again, if anyone is in whispers, then that would be amazing. I feel like it's a little more inland. Yep, just dropped from 12 to 9 viewers instantly. Brilliant. There you go. Oh, I'm not going to watch if, if there's no Far Harbor. Ah, uh. <laughs> uh, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine, guys. This is more for, you know, my kind of curiosity. Because Don't Wish Bore is, I've always avoided it. There's a bunch of, like, I think ghouls there? I think there's ghouls, and I think there is uh, raiders. You can't go that way. I don't know where I'm going. I'm not helping you. You're on your own. Brilliant. Love you too, J. Guess. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go find a map. Wow, you guys. Holy moly. I'm gonna go find a map then. Fine. There you go. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Just keep watching, okay? Talk amongst yourself for a second. I should probably quickly check my followers as well, because some people followed. I certainly didn't have 185 at the start of the night, so... Yeah, unless Cigar Smoke is just pulling my leg. I mean, people pull my leg all the time. It gets quite awkward, really. I'm like, why are you pulling my leg? And I just, just keep talking at it. Uh, Butthurt Pony and uh, Goldkeeper101. Thank you for the follows, good friends. Welcome to the... Upstart TJ... Fun Club 3000. Yeah, there you go. You like that? Yep. You like that, guys? No? Alright then. Okay. Dunwich Borers. I, I mean, Dunwich Borers, it, it's actually quite interesting because I don't know how many of you have played Fallout 3, but in Fallout 3, there was an area in Fallout 3 called uh, Dunwich Tower or Dunwich Building or something like that. And in it, you started having, like, flashbacks. There was, like, you, you could have, like, flashbacks whilst in uh, Dunwich uh, building. And I think the entire kind of Dunwich quest line is, well, the Dunwich kind of thing is all to do with an old Lovecraft story or something. I don't know if any of, you's, any of you are familiar with, with Lovecraft, but... Uh, I think he was like an author that did a lot of weird stuff, like weird kind of probably tentacle monsters coming out the sky and whatnot. And I think the whole Dunwich kind of flashbacks were all to do with that, or at least uh, anyway. I'm back, by the way, guys. You can now uh, you can now chat away and uh, tell me all the lovely stuff you've been saying about me whilst I've been gone. Doug, I'm I'm sure that was a really good map. Did you whisper me whisper me that map? I... Ooh, did you? Where are you? Where is that whisper? Someone's whispered me. And I can't see it. Is it down here? Uh... Doug, if you've whispered me, I can't see it. It tells... Wait, no, that no, you haven't. Who's whispered me? Oh, that is confusing. Holy moly. Okay. Someone's whispered me, but unfortunately, can't check it. 
That's gonna be that's gonna that's gonna that's gonna be really annoying. That's it, it's telling me I've got whispers, but I I can't see them. But yeah, um, it, it, it's interesting. The the whole Dunwich kind of storyline is quite interesting. There's no kind of quest attached to it per se, but the it's an experience to say the least. There you go. H.P. Lovecraft, author of Dunwich Horrors, guy loves his Cthulhu. <gasps> I'm Aka Pro. Welcome to the stream. See, I knew that. I, I knew that I was almost right. There you go. Thank you, I'm Aka Pro, making me look slightly smarter than I probably am. So thank you, good friend. Hopefully, you have had a most magnificent day. I hope you have. I really do, I'm Aka Pro. I really do. And I'm glad that you're here, good sir. Anyway, let's get there. Oh, no, no, that's not food. Not food at all. Dusky Yao Guy. Interesting. Can I make you explode? I can. Oh, that just what a what a what a great game this is. Slightly, only slightly. I'm I'm not saying that I'm super intelligent, but uh, I'm like a pro, kind of helping me out there. How do you get the battery and slash or crown symbol in your name? Well, my good sir, I'm sure these fine people would be able to tell you, but I do believe that the crown is given to people who have Amazon Prime, and the battery is given to people who have Turbo. Check your whispers. Okay. Checking them now, Dougie. There you go. There you go. I got it in the end, Doug. Got it in the end. Is this a virus? This is probably a virus, isn't it? Let's check. Ah, no, it's a full map. And let's just confirm... Oh, it's a bit small for me, but I think that is right. Yeah, top right-hand corner. Okay, good. Cheers for that, Doug. Best guy. Thank you. Uh, but yeah, the, basically, the crown is Amazon Prime, and the uh, battery is Turbo. I thought they were doing away with Turbo. I thought the Turbo was going to be, like, Prime or something. Didn't Jake... I think... I think it was you, Jay Gazmar, who said that once you've run out of turbo, it would switch you to prime or something? Is another thing? Can't quite remember. Oh god, it's so much better just playing this game in first person, by the way. <laughs> Holy moly. <laughs> oh lordy. Right, am I close? I'm getting there. This look like Dunwich Borers to you guys. I hope it is. Because I really want to see. Okay. Blood bug. Oh, it's miles away. It's miles away, it's fine. It's fine guys, we don't need to don't need to bother it. Yeah, it's fine. You just stay up at there. You just stay up at there, big guy. We i I'm I'm fine. I'm fine. I don't need to fight. I'm in my lovely coat. I'm in my lovely top hat. We're good. Don't worry. It's not a virus. <laughs> it's alright man, I was only kidding. I know you wouldn't send me a virus. I'm sure many people watching my stream would. But, uh, no. You're a nice guy. And I love you, Doug. So don't worry about it. There it is. Okay. Alright. Now, I mean, guys. You guys are probably like, Ugh. But Far Harbor was going to be so fun. You were going to fail and everything. I'm going to fail here. Like, really, really badly. I don't know if you guys realize just how open this place is. And you know what? As lovely as this coat is, I think we're going to go back to our armor. Because uh, I need every little bit of help I can get. Turn still to those who have a serve. I've only just cancelled it to move to Prime. Ah, fair enough. Fair enough, good sir. Fair enough. Thank you. Thank you for making that perfectly clear for everyone that wishes to know. But yes, I need a bed. Like right now. God. Now, in the open... Oh! Idiot Savant, thank you very much. Right. Uh, now, as you can see, in the distance... A couple of raiders. Quite a few raiders around, actually. Terminal, what could this be? Now nah, you'll do fine, and we're enjoying your lovely voice. Oh yeah? Oh yeah, Melimore? You enjoy my lovely voice? <gasps> Melimore. Mm. Jagaz. Mm. I'm Mac a pro. Mm. Yeah? You like that? Lovely voice? 
Uh, I will fix it now. There you go. Imaka now has a crown. Very good, man. Very good. All right, let's shut down these turrets. Holy moly. Okay. That was a little... Oh, hello! <laughs> That's an idiot, Savant, surely. Really? Do I really get 340 from just raiders now? Holy crap. Mostly. Oh, Jagas. I feel like every answer to every question regarding me must have the word mostly in it. Do you enjoy Upstart DJ's stream? Mostly. Do you think that he's a nice guy? Mostly. <laughs> ah, I love you too, guys. I love all you guys. Holy crap, this place is going to be redonkulous to, to get through. Do you reckon that place up there has a bed? Oh, God, I really need a bed right now. Um, The slog won't give me a bed. Let's just go in. You know what? Balls to the wall, guys. We're not racing anymore. I'm done with my 50 levels. Let's just go in, right? Brave? A bit. Sort of. Possibly. Sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. I mean, I laugh, but inside my heart is breaking. Holy crap. <laughs> Oh my lord. Right, okay. Let's uh let's just let's just go for it guys. Let's just go for it. Balls to the wall. Yep. Ain't no need for no bed. Although if there is one in this building, I will take it. Cause Eddie Cuts is tired, ladies and gentlemen. He's a sleepy cat. Sleepy old cat he is. Ah I kind of wanted to check his body for food, but you know what? That's fine. That's absolutely fine. Kinda, I guess. <laughs> uh, beds in here. No. Beds around. Beds in here. Right away. Oh, carrying too much. Brilliant. Uh, uh, do I need to eat? Yeah, I do. Alright, okay. The old, the old melon. Go for the old melon. Go for the old uh, deathclaw meat. We're not going to be cooking food for a little while. There you go. And uh, pop a purified water. Add, add some fit, fit road. Purified water, fit road. Ah, uh, excuse me. Excuse me. Uh, got the burps. Right, how do we get down from here then? And you. I could check this guy's body now, can't I? Uh, stim packs. Now, I actually still need stim packs. For those of you that are watching Melimore's streams, her race, she's got about 144 stim packs currently. Yeah, I don't need... I'm not going to pick it up. I'm not going to pick it up. Holy crap, Jagaz, that was for you. I'm going to pick it up. I can't help myself. I have to pick it up. It's good money. It's good money. We sold We sold a load at the start of the, the, the stream, so it's worth it. You are going to die, by the way. Cool. Thank you for informing me. Um... Uh, I, I appreciate it. I'm going to do my best not to, but uh, I appreciate it, Doug. I appreciate it. I will do my best not to, friend. I will do my best to prove you wrong. Holy moly. <laughs> I think we should probably go from that angle. Or just avoid everything. Holy crap, this is going to be monstrous. Just you and me. Nothing personal. Okay. Oh, don't glitch my game. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare glitch my game. I like being able to look up. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. You heard and saw nothing. Kinda. Kinda scared. Oh, good! Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna go find a bed. <laughs> ah, where would the nearest bed be? Oh, God! See, we're hidden. We're fine. We don't need a bed. Just jump. Wow. Run at them. Do you guys actually want me to die? Is, is, that, is that what I'm hearing right now? 
because, uh, guys, that's, that's a little cruel. <gasps> I wonder if there's a bed in the Museum of Witchcraft. Or in Salem. Is this Salem? I don't know any areas in this game. I feel like I should go find a bed. Let's go find a bed, shall we? Unless anyone knows where a bed may be. It's up to you whether you want to tell me. But I'm going to go search this area for a bed. Yeah. In that hall is a bed. Oh, right. Okay, cool. I'll just jump in the middle and uh, see what happens. Yeah. Eddie Cutts is afraid of nothing, but... Um, he might be afraid of breaking his ankles. <laughs> right. Uh, oh! Hello. Okay. Old quick draw upstar DJ. Oh yes. Ain't no one faster than upstar DJ, which uh not always a good thing, believe me. Uh right. We we got him. I wonder if there's a bed in here. I wonder. Hmm. Let's find out, shall we? Yeah, it's interesting. You think Salem is safe? <laughs> well, I mean, I am part witch. So, uh, yeah, I think we might be done. In that hall is a bed. At Dunwich Mine is a bed. There is, like, a hideout. No kidding this time. Right. Well, okay. Well, I mean, Sneeze, I, I feel you. But I have a feeling that I'm just not going to make it down there, like, safely first time round. So I would like to kind of save my progress. But that is good to know. Good to know that there's a halfway stage that I can take advantage of. Um, I mean, if there's no bed upstairs, there's not going to be one downstairs here. Uh kind of lucky that you're floating mate cuz uh that hole uh ah <laughs> oh, dear i love this game ah uh, yeah i'm pretty sure there's no bad here <laughs> actual actual witchcraft i thought you were real Actual oh. witchcraft. All right, I'm kind of scared right now. Yeah, I'm kind of scared. There's no beds here. Eh, oh wait, nope, that's not the bed. I would sleep on the floor here. I'd be fine with that. No, no beds. No bed arenas. No bed arus. Nope, no beds, guys. No beds at all. All right, screw it then. Screw it. Uh, where am I going? What am I doing with my life? Is it this way? It is. Oh, it's not. It's not. Oh, wait. Oh, bed? No? In here? Maybe? Confusion. No? Okay. God damn it. Oh, well. Oh, Daniel Lee! Welcome to the stream! How you doing, man? How you doing, Seth? How you doing? How are you doing, good guy? How you, do how you doing, big guy? Bed? Wait, did you see a bed? Doug, did you see a bed? Really? Did you actually see a bed in there? Oh, joke. Oh, Doug. Uh, you guys know I'm so easily, like, you know, <laughs> convinced of everything. I'm so gullible, guys, so please, please, be nice to me. Don't say my stream's frozen when it's not. Don't say there's a bed when there's, like, none. You're better. Oh, good. I'm glad that you're better. Were you ill last time? I can't remember. I'm sorry, Daniel Lee. Oh. Now, Jago's mom said that this place isn't terribly safe. Now, I mean, the super mutant butcher on the doorstep suggests... Yeah, she's probably... But you know what? That's fine. There's a hospital here, and usually, hospitals have beds. Hopefully, anyway. Yeah, here we go. Oh. Oh, I feel my, my witch blood boiling already. Oh, God. Do, do you know what I love about this stream, guys? Do you know what I love about this stream? We've actually done nothing. We've done nothing. Are, are any of you guys enjoying this stream, even though we've done nothing? Like, like seriously, guys. We've, we've done nothing. The, nothing has been done. All we've done is walked and talked. Like, that's it. We've, we've done nothing. Nothing at all has been done. 
I mean, how does that make you guys feel, knowing that nothing has been done in this stream? At all. Uh, no, super depressed. Why are you depressed, Daniel Lee? Talk to me, man. Go to the mine. Up at the ridge of the mine is a hideout for one of the Dunwich borers. I'm pretty sure there is a bed there. Go to the mine. Up at the ridge of the mine. Uh, go to the mine. Up at the ridge of the... Right, okay. Uh, I'm going to have one quick look around here. And if there's nothing, I will take advantage of that, okay? Typical. Is it typical? Is it typical of me to get nothing done? I, 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 I disagree completely. I'm very good at getting things done. It's just, just not today. <laughs> not today, it seems. <laughs> it is just fun hanging with you. Oh, goldkeeper. Oh, I love you, goldkeeper. Thank you. Thank you, goldkeeper. That is, that is a nice thing to say. I'm glad that you're enjoying hanging with me too, man. I mean, maybe after this, we could we, we could continue hanging out. We could go get milkshakes and uh, see if, you know, just, just just have some fun. Yeah, see see what happens. <laughs> but yeah, uh, glad you're having fun, man. Glad you're having fun. Buff out. That's a cool thing to have. Nope. Okay. Cool. What a lovely view, by the way. Holy crap. Who wouldn't want to live in Salem? Apparently, Jagas, because apparently it's dangerous. Right, there has got to be a bed in Salem. Between the cutted rocks, there is a turret with a lot of rats. But behind that is a bed. So are you saying that it's on the actual top bit? Like the ridge of it? Like the very top? Uh, Daniel Lee, my auntie was taken to the police station for my cousin's suspicious broken bone. Oh, that ain't good. I hope, well, I mean, I hope she's okay. Oh, I hope everyone's okay. I mean... It's probably wrong of me to ask, but like, does does your auntie like to break bones? I mean, I I, I don't know. I don't know, man. It's it's on the ridge, is it? All right. Kind of want to. Oh god. Yeah, I'm think I'm gonna go back to Dunwich. I uh, I need. Uh, oh, I don't know what to do anymore. Oh uh, god. Yep. You know, Tice. You've been good, man. You've been good to me. But... Covalescence home. I'm going to check this one place. If there's no bed in here, I will go back to Dunwich and we'll find that bed that you've been talking about. We're, gonna, we're probably going to hit that bed anyway. DJ, WTF, why would you even say that? <laughs> Daniel Lee, I'm sure that your auntie is a lovely person, and she would not dream of breaking your cousin's uh, bone, whatever bone that may be. So, um, yeah, I, I hope that your auntie 